Hear ye, hear ye, hearty and f hail fellow travelers. Mm, that's not quite right. Greetings, bad friends. Mm, no. Hey, turkeys! <laughs> that's completely wrong. Greetings, First Parish family, friends, and fans. Yeah, that seems better. Welcome to our news update for Friday, October 29th, 2021. News that you can use in a flash. Well, obviously we've got an exciting and fun uh, weekend ahead of us with Halloween and all the costumes and everything like that. Um, join us for worship. It is going to be a wonderful service of worship. The children are going to continue their exploration of the story of Moses with a little bit of a celebration. Hmm, wonder what that could be. And also in our message, I'm going to talk about um, the fact that we are not far from the kingdom. That sounds like good news. Hmm. Well, anyways, come down for worship. Join us in the sanctuary, 10 o'clock on Sunday morning. Wear your masks. Come on down. If you can't join us in person, do join us on our live stream. Just go on to the church website, www.firstparasaco.org, and click on the live stream link. And, of course, you can watch our services anytime, day or night, in the middle of a, a meeting at work. You can watch our services on YouTube. So just go on to YouTube and search for First Parish Saco. You can watch it anytime. Not an important meeting, of course. Those boring meetings are only. But, but do join us on Sunday morning or anytime for worship this week. It is Halloween on Sunday. And so after the worship service, we are going to have a Sunday school fall festival. All of our Sunday school children are invited to stick around, wear costumes, play some games, have some fun, eat some candy. And um, so come on down. All the, the, uh, the Sunday school children are welcome. And please, no scary costumes, just fun costumes or silly costumes or creative costumes. But come on down and join us for some, some fun and fellowship time after worship on Sunday. I did wear the, the, uh, the little turkey outfit as a way to remember that Thanksgiving is not that far away. And every year at Thanksgiving, we do prepare Thanksgiving baskets for our neighbors who might be experiencing some difficulty. We are gathering food items for those baskets. So if you can bring down non-perishable food items that, you know, that people would serve for Thanksgiving, we have a basket, a uh, shopping carriage right down in the entryway, um, collecting those items for our Thanksgiving food basket. So please do, you know, open your hearts and share with, with our neighbors for our Thanksgiving baskets. And finally, the season of Advent is also just right around the corner. We're going to do something really special this year. Uh, we're looking to illuminate our faith and our theme for Advent is going to be light. So what I'm looking for is artistic expressions of light. Whether you are a painter, a photographer, a, a sculptor, a knitter, a quilter, whatever your, your medium may be, looking for artistic expressions of light that we can put on display around the church during the season of Advent. Don't have to be a professional, just whatever you want to do, whatever you want to create as an artistic expression of light. Create it, bring it down, and help us illuminate our, our faith, illuminate the season of Advent with your light as we celebrate the light of the world coming into the world. Well, that's it, everyone. Have a great rest of the week. Be healthy, be safe. God bless.